and welcome, I am the Ghost Saboteurs, and in the news today is space again. Space.com! Yes, seems everything else is mainly pointed at um, Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton and shit like that. And 15 mysterious photos that they don't show you in history class. Anyway, they draw two photos, huh? <laughs> well, that's a shocker. I'll leave that in the description for you, too. <laughs> anyway, in the news article I found is um, titled Mysterious Unidentified Object. Oh, mysterious Unident Unidentified Object Crashes. In Myanmar, M Y A N M A R. Myanmar. And of course, it's a tweet. It says unidentified, unidentified piece of an aircraft believed to be an engine falls near Hepcadent Hep Jade Mine. HP HP A K A N T have can't I don't know. Sorry if I'm butchering these names. I'm not from the area. I'm from the UK, not from Myanmar. Apparently yeah. Yeah, it looks like a looks like a freaking name. Jet engine or something. I found a large unidentified metal object fell from the sky on yesterday. Today is what? 12th, so this two days ago. Today's the 12th, and this apparently fell yesterday. When was this up? Uh, 11th of November, this post was. It was up uh, about what? 12:15 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I probably I would have been in bed. So yeah, apparently it's about 12 feet long and five feet in diameter. Um, apparently blast into the village, blast into Lonkin near a Jade Mine. Apparently, villagers woke with in the morning with a uh, boom and vibrations. See the loud next door neighbours hammering, hammering it hard. What? You had the same idea, the same thoughts. Don't you lie. <laughs> Um so no one was injured it, no one was injured uh, but though the UFO went to the Jade Man's tent. Damn UFOs uh, apparently someone says in Italy in it in uh, but apparently they Thought it was a battle. Explosion made many houses shake, and smoke. F and they saw smoke from their village. Mm. Uh, a first glance says it's an aircraft uh, engine. Anyway, yeah, but yeah, I thought it'd be hilarious. I mean, interesting. But the other one is definitely hilarious, especially the first photo. The look on the look on his face. Like a uh, shit. Yes, apparently these photos are from 14th 
uh, 14 where World War II photos you wouldn't didn't show you weren't you weren't shown in history class I'm gonna look through it look through these 14 photos anyway until next time people ladies and gentlemen farewell <laughs>